Hello and welcome to the Bike Century. My name's Ben and today I've got the pleasure of showing you around this MV Augusta Brutale 675. And the first thing you've got to say about this bike is how pretty it is. It's finished in the Ago colours. Um, you know, obviously the, the reference to Agostini is synonymous throughout MV Augusta uh, as their most successful rider. This bike is a 2013, it's on a 63, it's done just under 16,000 miles from new. Um, it's in really nice condition, I have to say. Uh, powered by a 675cc three-cylinder engine, which um, is not as synonymous with the brand, uh, but uh, actually works really well, very similar to uh, the Street Triple in that sense. Um, makes about 110 brake horsepower, which is plenty from a naked. It's great fun, it's very nimble, fly-by-wire throttle, loads and loads of goodies on this bike. Um, and yeah, just look how pretty it is. But let's start at the front. I'll give you a brief overview of the bike. So Brembo brakes, four pots on radial uh, calipers. Uh, the bike's fitted with braided lines as well uh, on 320 millimeter discs. So loads and loads of stopping power on this bike. Uh, 17 inch lightweight wheels on Pirelli tires, which are in great condition. Um, this bike is also fitted, you might see, with axle protectors from Evotech. So they're a, they're a good quality brand. Just behind the front wheel, you can't really see, but there is one there. There is a radiator guard. Um, nice thing to have on any naked bike. Just stops all the stones, dirt and crap flicking up the front of the bike uh, and causing any harm or damage. As I've already mentioned, finished in Yago colours. So silver accented with a red tank. Very, very common for MV Augustas. The paint works in very, very good condition. There's no major marks, scratches, dings, dents, chips, anything like that at all. Of course, being a used bike, you will find some wear and tear, but on the whole, cosmetically, this bike is very well finished. Got the standard original exhaust on it, which is quite rare. It's not been messed about with too much, this bike. It sounds really nice, but there are some aftermarket options uh, if you would like us to look into that for you. And we do offer free fitting on any accessories purchased with the bike. Single-sided swinging arm. Um, I really like this on any bike. Really, really looks cool. Very tidy back end and those triple exhausts. Uh, just finish off that hot rod look at the back end. It's got Brembo brakes hidden behind there as well. Very powerful rear brake on these. Um, really, really good bit of kit. As I pan up a little bit, you'll see there's a seat cowl on there. Um, that actually covers the uh, the rear seat unit. It doesn't replace it, so you can pop that off uh, if you want to. And we do also have the pillion pegs as well if you want those refitted. Uh, aftermarket towel tidy. I believe it's Evotech uh, with the standard indicators and a standard size plate. Really lovely bikes these, as I said, fly-by-wire throttle. It takes a bit of getting used to, for sure, as there's nothing actually connected between here and here. Um, it, yeah, it does take a little bit of getting used to, but once you're used to it, um, it's sublime. You know, the uh, the handling, how it all works together, it just takes a bit of getting used to if you're getting off a traditional um, cable uh, throttle bike, basically. Um, aftermarket adjustable and folding levers. So you've got span adjusters on here on both sides. Um, Signature Brutale headlight. This hasn't really changed in design across any of the Brutales. All very similar. Uh, very big oval. Looks very cool. Very Italian. As is the tank. You know, the tank on these always stick out. You know, if I could show you from the top, see how wide the tank is at the top. Fairly typical of any MV Augusta. Um, on this side, it's very much the same. So, same brakes on this side. Loads and loads of braking power. Uh, no quick shifter fitted to this bike as standard, though it does come with traction control. Uh, no ABS on this model either. Very clean and tidy bike, recent chain and sprockets as you can see, things like chain sprockets, brakes, tyres, they're all checked as part of our pre-delivery inspection um, and obviously if we find any issues we do replace or rectify. Um, the only cosmetic mark I could find on this bike is a little chip just here, um, obviously where someone's nicked it with their foot as they've swung their leg over, could easily be touched up but obviously always worth disclosing um, before you purchase a bike. Uh, we've got all the keys, owners, manuals and service history. If you're interested in exactly what we've got there, please let us know. Uh, fully digital dash on these. Uh, it's just going for its cycle. Um, so, yes, you've got your gear position just here. Um, you've obviously got your engine map just here, it tells you, so you can cycle through those, so you can go through different modes. Uh, you've got your traction control indication up here, your speed, uh, 15,983 miles from new. Obviously, your clock. Uh, your temperature and your fuel and everything are on the right hand side let's give her a start up for you sorry i'll pull the clutch in first and then i'll give her a start up
Sounds absolutely epic. You really need to scream these to get the sound of the triple to come out, which is a shame. Uh, hence my remark about the aftermarket exhaust. Uh, the bike's gonna come with a three month warranty. It'll come with free delivery within England and Wales. Sorry if you're in Scotland, we do deliver there, but you're gonna pay a small charge. Uh, we offer finance and Partex as well. So if those are things that you're interested in, or if you've got any questions about the bike, please feel free to reach out. We've got WhatsApp, live chat, all the socials. Pick up the phone and ask us any questions that you got or drop into the showroom for a coffee and you can try the bike on for size. That's it from me. Thanks for watching and I look forward to speaking to you soon. Take care.